Imagine this. It's 2026, and you walk into a hospital in Shanghai. Instead of a human nurse, you're greeted by a lifelike robot that checks your temperature, asks about your symptoms, and even cracks a joke to ease your nerves. Sounds like sci-fi, not in China. Over the next few minutes, we're diving into how China is turning this vision into reality, and why humanoid robots could redefine our world faster than you think. Let's rewind a bit. China's obsession with humanoid robots isn't new. Back in 2022, companies like Ubtech and Xiaomi stunned the world with prototypes that could walk, talk, and even dance. But today, it's no longer about novelty, it's about strategy. The Chinese government has poured billions into AI and robotics, aiming to dominate the global tech race. Why humanoids? Because they're versatile. Unlike factory robots bolted to assembly lines, humanoids can navigate our messy, human world, climbing stairs, gripping coffee cups, and understanding slang. By 2026, China wants these machines everywhere, hospitals, factories, even your home. Take UBTECH's walker robot. In 2022, it could barely shuffle across a room. Now, it practices Tai Chi in public parks, mirroring human movements with eerie precision. Engineers say by 2026, Walker will handle complex tasks like cooking meals or tutoring kids. But here's the kicker. China isn't just building better robots, they're making them cheaper. While a humanoid bot costs $100,000 today, Experts predict prices will drop to under $20,000 by 2026. That's thanks to China's manufacturing muscle and a little trick called, cloud robotics. Imagine a robot that doesn't need a super-powered brain, it streams its intelligence from the cloud, like Netflix for AI. That means lighter, cheaper, and smarter machines. Xiaomi, the smartphone giant, is betting big here. Their Cyber One robot isn't just a tech demo, it's the cornerstone of their smart home empire. By 2026, Xiaomi wants these bots to sync with your fridge, lights, and security system. Picture this, your robot notices you're out of milk, orders it via voice command, and then chats with your kid about homework. Creepy, maybe, convenient, absolutely, but China's ambitions go beyond gadgets. In factories, humanoids are being trained for flexible, small batch production. BYD, the electric vehicle Titan plans to replace half its workforce with robots by 2026. And in healthcare, bots like Fourier Intelligence's rehab assistant are already trialing in Shanghai hospitals, helping stroke patients regain movement. Now, let's talk about the darker side. These robots aren't just assistants, they're potential lifesavers. China's tested firefighting bots in earthquake drills, sending them into collapsed buildings too dangerous for humans. By 2026, they could be first responders in disasters worldwide. But with great power comes great controversy. Critics warn of job losses, will millions of factory workers end up unemployed? China's answer. Massive retraining programs. The government's funding courses in AI maintenance and coding, aiming to turn factory workers into robot supervisors. Then there's privacy. A robot with cameras and mics in your home. China's rolling out strict data laws, but skeptics say it's a band-aid on a bullet wound. And let's not forget the global angle. China's rise in robotics is rattling the US and Japan, longtime leaders in the field. This isn't just about tech, it's geopolitical. Humanoid robots could become the next battleground in the AI Cold War. But here's the twist. China's robots might not stay in China. Just like they conquered the drone market with DJI, Companies like Ubtech are eyeing global exports. By 2026, your local hospital or warehouse could be running on Chinese bots. The question is, will the world embrace them, or fear them? A montage of elderly people interacting with companion robots. Host on camera, softer tone. Amid all the hype, there's a human story here. China's population is aging fast. By 2035, 400 million people will be over 60. Humanoid robots could fill the caregiver gap, offering companionship to lonely seniors. Researchers are even experimenting with emotional AI, bots that read your facial expressions and tone. Imagine a machine that notices you're sad and plays your favorite song. It's not real empathy, but for someone isolated, it might be enough. Still, it's a double-edged sword. 
Do we want robots raising our kids and burying our elders? Or is this just progress we can't stop? A futuristic cityscape where robots and humans walk side by side. Love it or hate it, China's robot revolution is unstoppable. By 2026, these machines will walk among us, smarter, cheaper, and more integrated into daily life than ever. They'll challenge our ideas about work, privacy, and what it means to be human. But here's the thing. Technology doesn't have a moral compass. It's up to us, governments, companies, and citizens, to steer it wisely. So, what do you think? Are humanoid robots humanity's next great leap, or a step into the unknown? Drop your thoughts below, and if you're curious what's coming next in AI, hit subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you in the future.